device overview. Sigma is the unique metal detecting device with its special performance and clear results. Advanced technologies provide the smart pulse and spectrum analyzer systems the ability to detect gold, metals, and cavities for depths of up to 8 meters by easily set configuration to get highly accurate and guaranteed results. Device Parts The device case contains the following. Main unit, 5-inch color display. Battery compartment and battery pack inside the main unit grip. Grip key. Charging port, headphone jack. Two light carbon fiber pools, which are Upper pool, contains User armrest Main unit holder Pool expanding latch Lower pool, contains Connector for the surge coil and pool Plastic bolt and nut to hold the surge coil Car charger, headphones, connection module, charging adapter, plastic bolt and nut, surge coils. The following coils are available for this device. Surge coil C1, 18 cm by 18 cm, featuring a small profile with lightweight and providing the required accuracy for detecting tiny target, thus the best search tool for long tracking sessions. Search coil C2, 35 cm by 35 cm. The ideal search coil for medium-sized target on different ranges. Whether the targets are deep or close to the ground surface, without a loss in signal integrity or sensitivity. Search coil C3 40 cm by 45 cm The deep tool for the device with its rectangular shape covers more search area for large and deep targets. Device assembly Partially loosen the nut on the main unit holder on the upper pull. Insert the main unit in the holder and tighten the fasteners securely. Unlatch the lock at the end of the upper pull. Insert the lower pull into it and extend it to the required length, then lock the latch back in. Insert the surge coil in the connector at the end of the lower coil and fasten the bolt there. Insert the connection module into multi-function system connector at the front of the main unit. Wrap the surge coil cable around the pole. Insert the connection module into multi-function system connector. Unlatch the lock to fix the surge coil position to be aligned with the main unit and lock it back again. Tips before initiating the surge. 1. Selecting the suitable location for the search system. The system is suitable for most of the locations as long as they are free of high voltage lines. Live scan system works best with flat ground surfaces. 2. Keep a 10 to 15 cm clearance distance between the bottom of the imaging scanner and the ground surface. 3. 
If the search is taking place in a closed housing, the electricity must be cut off first. Or, the user should remove any jewelry, metal accessories, watches, etc. before starting the search. First run. Press and hold the power key. After booting, the device shows the main menu, which contains the systems and settings icons. Spectrum Analyzer System Smart Pulse System System Overview Smart Pulse System The system is developed upon the pulse induction, which relies on emitting electromagnetic regulated pulses and receives the reflected signals from the metal targets underground to analyze whether it is ferrous or non-ferrous. The system also can locate cavities and underground voids like tunnels and tombs. It is recommended to start using this system to locate the target position. Spectrum Analyzer System This system detects gold and metals by analyzing a spectrum of readings taken in intervals then processed and visualized in 3D plotted surface indicating the depth and signal intensity at the search area. Smart Pulse System Search Interface Overview This interface contains three main indicators. The first one is the signal level indicator, shows the received signal intensity. The second indicator shows the signal quality. The third indicator shows the possibility of voids and ground cavities. The target window shows a waveform indicating metal target with red and void with blue, and an icon showing the connected surge coil. The system control icons are located on the left side of the interface, the scale icon for the ground balance process, sensitivity bar to adjust the sense to the required level, noise bar to select the signal noise level, Sample rate icon to set the device operation frequency. Iron filter icon to ignore iron based metals and targets from other signals. Sound tune selection icon. Take the following into consideration. The noise level is set according to the search area and soil type. If the search area is sandy, then the noise level can be increased to give a better performance. If the search area is rocky, the noise level might need decreasing to calibrate the device with the surroundings. When the noise level or sample rate are changed, the ground balance process should be done again. Decrease the noise level to the first, second or third level to increase battery lifetime. How to work and detect using the systems Smart Pulse System Ground Balance Press the grip key to activate the system control interface and the device will start working and making sound signals. Lay the search coil flat on the ground and select the scale icon to do the ground balance process, then press OK to reset signal, quality and void bars to the initial values. Wait until the device is not making any sounds. Lift the search coil about 30 cm and if the device does not make any sound, then the ground balance process is concluded. In case the signal is making a low sound, the ground balance can be fine-tuned by pressing the right and left arrows to clear the sound. If the device keeps making sound signals, then the ground balance process is not concluded yet. The ground balance process should be repeated until the device signal is stable and there is no more sound. Sensitivity bar Press right arrow to increase the sensitivity as long as the device signal is stable and there is no sound. Noise bar Press right arrow to increase the noise level to control the signal quality. The level can be increased as long as the signal is stable and there is no sound. Sample rate changes the device operating frequency. Iron filter 
activated by pressing OK or right and left arrows to make the device ignore various targets. Tune icon The device offers five different tunes. Use the arrow to change between them. Now, lift the surge coil 3 to 4 cm from the ground. Move the device over the surge area in sweeping motion left and right with moderate speed, while maintaining the surge coil parallel to the ground surface for high performance and accurate results. During the surge process, track the three surge bars and watch the signal levels, quality and void to enclose target. The signal bar starts to increase when the device detects a target nearby or getting closer. The quality bar level starts to increase and the device will process the target type according to that. Press OK to store the results showing on the interface and when the result storing is finished, a check mark will show. The results could be reviewed later in the storage inside the settings. To end the search process, press back key or turn off the system and press back key then press power key. Spectrum Analyzer System When the system is selected, the control interface shows the 1 meter squared target area right side of the interface, scale icon for the ground balance process, sensitivity bar to adjust the sense to the required level, noise bar to select the signal noise level, sample rate icon to set the readings taken in set duration, left side of the interface, metal signal and voids level bars the connected search coil. Take the following into consideration. The noise level is adjusted according to the search area and soil nature. If the search area is sandy, the noise level could be increased for better performance. If the search area is rocky, it might be needed to decrease the noise level to adjust the device with the surroundings. The ground balance process should be repeated after changing the sensitivity or noise level. To increase the device working hours, decrease the noise level. If there is more than one device working in the same area, each device should be set to a different sample rate. If a search was conducted in a smart pulse system earlier, the sensitivity, noise, and sample rate values remain the same in Spectrum Analyzer system. The search area is optimized for 1 by 1 meters area. How to use and detect Spectrum Analyzer system Ground balance Press the grip key to activate the control interface so the device would start working and emitting sound signals. Put the search coil on the ground and select balance icon, then press OK to reinitialize the signal levels. Wait until the sound signal could not be heard from the device. Lift the device 30 cm and if the device does not make any sound, then the ground balance is completed. If a low signal sound is heard, the ground balance could be fine-tuned by pressing the left and right arrows over the scale icon to eliminate the sound. If the device kept making high signal sounds, then the ground balance process has failed and should be repeated again. Move to the sensitivity and press the right arrow key to increase the sensitivity level. Keep increasing until a faint sound signal is emitted and stop. Move to the noise level icon and press the right arrow key to increase the noise level and control the signal quality. Keep increasing as long as the device is stable and not making any sound signals. Move to the sample rate where the device operating frequency could be changed. Lift the surge coil 3 to 5 cm from the ground while maintaining the surge coil parallel to the ground during the surge operation for maximum performance and accurate results.
press the grip key and notice four arrows showing on the edges of the search square. The one in red indicates the start position of the search coil. The starting point could be changed using the arrow keys. Press the OK key to start the search operation and move the search coil from the middle of the selected edge with the green bar towards the middle of the opposite edge. When the bar is finished, a check mark will show at the starting edge. Repeat the process for the remaining edges. The device starts processing the collected readings into a 3D plotted surface, representing the signal intensity and display it in the middle of the interface with a target type and estimated depth displayed on the left side in centimeters. Press OK to save the search results, and once the saving process is finished, a check mark will show in the middle of the search interface. To conduct a new search, go to the right arrow and press the OK key to start over again. To exit the search system, go to the red arrow on the left of the save icon and press OK. The saved result could be reviewed by going to the device settings, then the storage and selecting the saved result from there.